In this demonstration, you'll learn how to perform the installation for ANSYS Release 19.0 on the Windows platform. Before proceeding, close all Windows applications. You will need to download product files from the ANSYS Customer Portal and extract them to an accessible directory. Have the hostname of the licensed server machine available. This tutorial will begin in the directory containing the extracted installation files. Right-click Setup and select Run as Administrator. Click Install ANSYS Products. Two icons have been added to the installation screens. The question mark icon displays an explanation of the functionality available on that screen. The letter I icon displays information about the release version of the installation software. Read the ClickWrap software license agreement completely. If you agree to the terms, select I agree and click Next. Accept the default installation directory, or you may enter your own directory at this time. Leave the Associate File Extensions with ANSYS Products checkbox enabled. This allows you to double-click files from Windows Explorer to launch the various products. Click Next to continue. Enter your licensed server machine's hostname in the Hostname field. If your company is running a redundant triad server configuration, select the Three Server Redundant Triad option and enter all three servers in the spaces provided. Please note that if a licensed server specification already exists on your system, you will not see this screen during the installation process. Click Next. The product selection screen automatically displays all products contained in the installation package you downloaded. The installation program queries your licensed server to pre-select your installation options. If the installation program was unable to query your licensed server, the default installation options are selected. A check mark signifies that the product and all related child products are enabled for installation, while a gray box indicates that some, but not all of the products are enabled for installation. You can expand the tree view to select any additional products you wish to install. Select the products you wish to install. Click Next to continue. If you are installing a geometry interface, the CAD configuration screen is displayed. This screen contains the configuration properties for each CAD product that you have selected in an expanded accordion view. For the purposes of this tutorial, we have selected Creo Parametric Geometry Interface. Choose the configuration option you desire from the CAD configuration screen. We will select the Reader option. This technique is the same for all other CAD interfaces. SpaceClaim Direct Modeler is installed by default as part of ANSYS Workbench. There is no need to select an option here. Click Next. Confirm the products to be installed. Should you not see a product you wish to install, you can use the Back button to return to the product selection screen. Click Next. Your selected products are now extracted and installed. You can click the View Detailed Progress Log option to see the progress of the extraction and installation. Once the product installation has completed, click Next to continue. Review the screen for any messages. A Launch Survey Upon Exiting option is included here. Clicking Exit while this option is enabled causes your default browser to open, displaying the product survey. Click Exit to close the installation utility. This concludes this demonstration of the ANSYS Release 19.0 installation on the Windows platform.